the latest feature to be added to our already fantastic signal generator functionality are the signal generator triggers. These options allow the signal generator to output one or more waveform cycles in response to a trigger condition. This is especially useful when spotting glitches and a requirement to enable the signal generator to output a waveform exists. As you can see on my blue channel, channel A, there is a pulse train and within that pulse train there is a glitch. I'm going to trigger the signal generator off this glitch, but first I'll need to set up my trigger conditions by using a pulse width trigger. This is one of eight advanced trigger functions available. As you can see, I've now triggered off my glitch. I can now go in and enable the signal generator trigger. To enable the signal generator trigger, enable the trigger's active dialog. The trigger source is scope or manual external input. In this instance, I've used scope. As you can see now, I have triggered the signal generator off this glitch. I can change the signal type by using a square or triangle or sine x over x. This is all customizable. I can also use a signal generator trigger with using a manual input. Alternatively, I can use the external input of a scope. Thank you very much.